What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened? Like... What even was that? Hello and welcome to Baby Bunting Wrestling, guys. Welcome, welcome. We are one week away from currently titled Merry Spookums Ooh. Wrestling Halloween pay per view next week. So get excited, get excited guys. for that because I wouldn't miss it if I were you. It's going to be oh, very lead. Lead. Hey! Maybe we'll bump into some people on the way. Some people we know we in Leeds. might bump into us. Might bump Never into know. us. Oh, we might be right there, literally in the crowd. That'd be crazy. Yeah. Perhaps. We're not already there. Of course. No, no, no. We're here. Okay, so our first match is Panda versus Joby One. Do Indeed. you want to explain the reasoning behind this? Uh, certainly. So, obviously, Panda... Introduced last week to the Baby Bunting Wrestling roster, did very well in his first match against who was it? Was it Pooh Bear? It wasn't Pooh Bear, was it? It was Pooh Bear. Won against Pooh Bear, obviously yes, ex champion. Yes, it was the match of the bears. Yeah, all oh, the bears. Pooh Bear versus Panda Bear, of course. Panda won, so obviously it sets him in a good light because former champion Pooh Bear defeated by newcomer Panda. Uh, Joby won, on the other hand, uh, wasn't very happy with this because Joby won as also a former champion, on a bit of a loss streak, unfortunately at the minute, the Chosen not doing well just in general as a group. I think there's a bit of friction in, in the group at the minute, not a lot of things. I think Joby One's coming out on his own here. I don't think that he's supported by his fellow Chosen members this week, oh, so that's good. interesting, even though they are wrestling later tonight. Um, but yeah, so Joby One not super happy with what's going on within the Chosen and within Big Bunting Wrestling as a whole. And yeah. so he wants to show that Pooh Bear, former champion, he's nothing compared to Joby One, former champion. So Panda's got another another former champion on his hands. Let's see how he does. As he's in the chat right now, Emperor Panda, hello. How are you, Emperor Panda? Are you excited for your match today? Should we make a poll? Poll, Spiring? yes. I'm always terrible at remembering the polls. Get gambling nowadays. those channel points, guys. Okay, Panda versus Joby One. I know that timing perfect. As soon as your characters come out, perfect timing. Spawn. Absolutely perfect timing. We are late on today. Just been a busy day of having fun. Seeing as Farron's off work today. So it's been a long Indeed. And I'm off work because it's the holidays. Half term. Oof, oof. Only one week. I wish it was two. Or more. Or six, you know. <laughs> I feel like every every holiday should be six weeks. What's next? Is it is Christmas the next holiday is now after mm -hmm. this? Okay. It is indeed. I wish there was another. Yeah, that seems so far away, but it's not really that far away actually, which is a bit scary. Mm. But. And then after that is February. Yeah. So I'm intrigued. I feel like Panda's probably gonna win this. I feel like Joby One's been doing rubbish, and I, I think he's overconfident. I just remembered I was going to do that channel point. Do you know a little channel point prediction thing that pops up on the screen as well to show the voting? I was going to get that ready for the next question. Oh, that's all right. If you've got it ready for the pay per view, I think that's my exciting. That's Bring in the new stuff for the pay per view event. Yeah. All right. They're getting straight. Oh, oh my days. Referee got in the way a little bit there. Watch yourself. It's always the chosen. It's all these tag teams always seem to go up against the ref. Every time at the start of a match, you get somebody. Somebody either hits him or launches somebody Yeah, I, I do fear for his safety, to be honest. He's had a bit of trouble these last couple of weeks. That's for certain. Oh, Emperor Panda kicking him. Oh, he missed. Now, interestingly, both characters are a fan of, of the high-flying moves. You wouldn't expect it because they're both quite big fellas. Laying a lot of punches, well, a lot of kicks. Well, I wouldn't but... say Jervy ones is a very big fella. Maybe not, but... Oh, Panda's already down right now. Pick out at one. Out at one. So it's the game sound playing, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's yeah, very yeah. quiet. It's just quiet for you. Yeah, you're, mine's very quiet. Your headphones at like minus three volume. <laughs> so you pull out ears. Mm, gosh, that knee to his face. One count unlike your last match. Wait, what do you mean what happened in the last match? Well, Come on, Panda, Panda get on up. the floor. Joe one slides out to meet him. Oh, a big... Big toe to his head. Oh. But Panda fighting back. Knees to the groin. Oh, elbow to the head. Oh, oh my days, absolutely drops him. If it isn't the one and only Skengiwi as Whoa. well. 
Oh, watch out, jump one. Ah! Oh, it was jump two one. count on your first pin last time. Oh, that knee juice, babe. Jump one, too busy having a, a show off in the outside that Panda <laughs> just takes the fight straight to him. Uh, I don't feel like Jovi one should have wanted to fight against Panda. He's he's another Gabe. He's coming in strong. Yeah. Oh, no. Not the fingers. No, no not the fingers. <laughs> Oh, it's not the one and only Spyro, though, is it? No, it's, I'm <laughs> just Spyro. I'm just me. <laughs> How are you, Skangiwi? Okay, we're at How are you count. as well, Panda? How are you doing? Okay, both competitors back in the ring for the time being. Oh, oh and a Superman punch to Joby 1. Is he out? One, He's looking one, dazed, looking confused. Two. Oh, oh, kick out a two, kick out a two. Okay. I really thought I had him then already. It's a big, big move. They are very big moves. Oh, these poor side, man. Joby won. Panda, you are being brutal tonight. You've oh, no. Got absolutely no mess. Not again. Oh, no, the fingers. fingers. Ah! Brutal. How's he going to lick oh. his spoon in the morning <laughs> oh, for his cereal? I'm not being funny. I would be very surprised if Joby won does not have. Oh, spear. An injury at the end of this. One. Is with a spear? Two. Damn. Joby won. Bruh. What is going on? This is another Gabe. Panda, you are another Gabe. Gabe, Gabe came in, new wrestler. And it was really funny as well because somebody else was commenting saying, oh, well, new wrestlers will be at a disadvantage. They won't be able to, like, they won't have worked their way up the ranks so they won't be able to take on these big people. No, Gabe came in, just beat everybody. And I feel like you are going the exact same way. If, if Gabe doesn't lose his belt, I think it would be very interesting to see if Panda still climbs the ranks and has to take on Gabe because I would love to see who would win out of Gabe yeah. and Panda because they've both come in so strong in the exact same way. And on the other side of this match, obviously Joby won losing. I can't imagine that the Chosen uh, are happy. I mean, Joby oh, won himself man. not happy, but I can't imagine the rest of the Chosen happy with the <laughs> leader literally not won a single match since the formation of the chosen. I that's mean, their those leader. Byron and Giga Chad haven't won very many either. But they at least have won matches. Yeah, they at that's least true. have won matches. Joe won is literally zero for like four or five now. Oh, that's bad. That's he not was good. a former champion. Former as champion. Well, what a fall from grace. What a fall from grace. I can't imagine they're gonna be happy about it. <laughs> Joey won looking all took it out right now. I know it very quickly it was it was took it out. Emperor Panda, how do you feel about your win, bro? You uh I feel bad because I feel like these matches are going too fast for you. Hopefully, at Halloween, Merry Spookums. Merry Spookums. Pay per view. There might be something. It might be a bit more exciting. Chosen cringe. Chosen cringe. No, yeah. boo. Look, oh, listen, 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 everyone. Look, you'll notice now, obviously, the next match is a tag team match. It's the council versus the chosen. The chosen being represented this time by Spiron and Giga Chad. This time, hopefully, we're about to see some classic. Chosen action. The classic chosen action generally actually is, is losing, it turns out, because that's the classic chosen action. So actually what we're not going to see is classic chosen action. This is revitalized chosen action. We're going <laughs> to see a win. Now, last week, you remember that the council tag team champions, of course, Garfield tag team champions, lost to the newly paired random tag team of John and Cupid last week. Mm. Very, very interesting. They sh they have to say a that great they've show. never been attacked, like they've never fought together or anything like that. Very interesting. Yeah, a great had. bit of synchronization between the two. They work together mm. very well. So we'll see. Actually, if that's maybe playing on the minds, maybe thinking, oh well, if we lost to this random tag team, this is an actual tag team. The chosen, even though they're a bit yeah. cringe, they might still beat us. We'll see. We'll the chosen see. Chosen cringe versus the cringe council. Indeed. Well, who will be the most cringe? Find out after this match. Oh, I'm glad that you're good, though, Skengiwi. Zootropolis is a very nice film. Very wholesome. Did Mum Giwi enjoy it as well? Who's coming out first? The council doing their jump move as always. Yeah, I'm just ign ignore, ignore that, but here we go. <laughs> well, I mean... It's, I think it's one of King of Doom's abilities. I mean, he's allowed to come in using his abilities. He might not be allowed to use them in his matches. But... It's true, but every time I guess outside of that, it's fair game. Mm. Trick question. They are both equally cringe. Oh my Ooh. days. 
Half true counseling. Half true counseling. Cringe. I mean, you're getting booed here, King of Doom. No, you Emperor Panda, Penguin. You spawned died. Did, it, did you miss the end of your match? Emperor Panda, you won. You won. Again. You're on a roll, my dude. All the chosen are cringe. I feel like a few people might disagree with that, King of Doom. Scratch that council on more cringe. Yeah, get a woo. Get true, a true. Well, here they are. Oh, they're getting booed quite loudly today. Well, they I feel deserve like that's it. louder than usual. Leads, not fans of the council. Yeah, for those who may have missed it, we are in Leeds currently. Nah, no, I would not agree. I don't feel like the Burly Boys are cringe. Tell me in what way the Burly Boys are cringe, because I can't think of one way. Got your belt. Leeds, you've been there. I've been there too. Guys, you'll be happy to know we've got the real life Garfield belt. On the couch right now, there he you is. just you can't, can't see him. You can't it's really too see dark. him, it's a bit dark, but he is there, I promise you. can kind of see that line. If you turn the light on for a second, everybody can see him. Hold on. At least the chosen agree anime is Annie Lane. <laughs> there he is. Can you see him any better? I've tried to turn the flashlight on. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. It makes like no difference. Oh. Tell me why we're the council cringe. It's just every way, bro. Yeah, they all play Genshin now. Boo. <laughs> what the? Can you, you play Genshin, bro. <laughs> Easy. D is for cringe and the council sat with let us see. <laughs> exactly. I played Cr Genshin Impact for like... I want to say you've got a literal like 10 minute playtime. No, now. I've definitely got more than 10 minutes. Maybe like an hour or two. Okay. Oh! Hey! Get the ref! Leave the, the referee ref, alone! Get the ref! <laughs> Every time! Meanwhile, B is for base, B for burly boys. Oh, uh, prediction, prediction, prediction. Uh, Skingy, we know she is cringe, but she is free. Oh, Faye is proper taking on Giga Chad. Guys, today. predictions are live, predictions are live. Boom! You know, I had to explain to somebody what, a, like, a, I had to explain to a teenager what a boomer was. Really? So I said, you must be a boomer because you don't know what it is. Yeah, damn. <laughs> oh! Hey, what a good move, Okay, Chad, neck's going to be hurting after that. Mm -hmm. He'll need a little bit of a massage backstage, I think, to unstiffen his neck. Okay, tagged in. King of Doom. Here he comes to face Giga Chad now. Oh! Surprised he didn't go for ref first, though. Yeah. <laughs> Giga Chad, is it just going to throw him straight out? No, nope. going to bounce him off the ropes. He's still in the ring for the time being, though. Giga Chad, on, known to be one who likes to throw people out of the ring. Maybe here we go Oy. now. He tried, but he didn't manage it. Oh, big punch. Oh, oh what's this about? Oh, and drops him on the apron of the ring. I don't feel like we've seen anybody do it that way before. That's got to hurt. Oh, getting his head smashed in as well. Also, JoJo stands for J, and J stands for J cringe. Oh, wow. Mortis. Oh, Mortis. Look, everyone, Mortis. <laughs> That's special hey. effects for you. Wow. That's this is the new, very running, high-quality, high-budget stream. <laughs> yeah, just because we added one thing. <laughs> exactly. Wow, that's a great point, Bunting Bot. Great point. Very relevant, obviously, because wrestlers wear underwear quite frequently so maybe guys in real life only show your underwear to people you care about true words to live by guys indeed now here's a man to live by it's spiron boy, spiron no 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 look at him yeah everyone Cringe shout boy. for spiron up he gets with king of doom why is king of doom saying no oh okay king of doom whatever floats your everybody boat everybody using that emote very accurately Okay, King of Doom trying to get to Faye. Does manage to get there as Spiron shows off. Now, it's Faye versus Spiron in the ring. Now, Faye out of the ring. Very quickly, <laughs> very quickly. Okay, what's oh, Spiron going to do next? He's going to wait. He's biding his time. He's conserving his energy. Just letting Faye get back in the ring herself. And then brings the fight straight back to her. Ooh. And now she's out of the ring again. In the ring, out the ring. In the ring, out the ring. Faye... 
Make up your mind. Okay, here we go. Sparring, taking the fight to fair now. Tag in that leg. Maybe that'll come into play <laughs> later. Maybe that's the game plan. Look at this tag oh, in the no. leg again. The same leg. <laughs> Weakening the left leg of Faye. Maybe this was the game plan discussed with Giga Chad beforehand. Ooh, and Ooh. just a slap to the head. A couple of slaps. A big boot. Those slaps are personal. Yeah, man. I'm really not sure who's going to win this. Like, at all. I'd like to think the Chosen have this, but it's not confirmed. Right, Sparring taking control. Throws Faye into the corner. Gives her a big right fist to the face. Oh, now targeting the arm. Oh. Okay. Limb targeting. First the leg, now the arm. Weakening Faye as much as they can before delivering the killing blow. Yikes. Good tactics from Spiring here. That's great, great advice also from a great man. Agree. Okay, Spiron has had enough for the time being. Tagging in Giga Chad. Now, Faye versus Giga Chad. Faye actually getting the upper hand straight away off of this. Oh, that's come up twice. Let's go. <laughs> Just reminding me if Skengiwi can do it, then anyone can. Truly. And I mean, Skengiwi, someone who's currently competing at oh. Mary Spookums for the, the Baby Bunting Championship. So, man, if she can do it, anyone can. Very true. Applies there Especially as well. Especially where she's come from. Being the bottom. The, the, the literal sewer dweller of baby bunting wrestling. To potential champion next week. Yeah. What a story. I'm intrigued to see. I could see her changing her whole get up as soon as she gets champion. Like, she felt like. I wonder if it'll go to her head a bit. Oh, what do you think? Possibly. I feel like she'll she becomes, go from rags to riches. Yeah, glam we. Oh. That'll be the next, the next, <laughs> the next phase. Oh, King of Doom getting absolutely wrecked here by Giga Chad. How are you feeling, King of Doom? Okay, Spiron now back in the ring. King of Doom dazed and confused. Throws a couple of punches, but Spiron managed to get a boot oh. in. Okay, Spiron has. Oh, King oh. of Doom up and down on the knees, going for the pin. Faye's gonna have to try and interrupt this. Oh, and does manage to get there in time. Giga Chad couldn't quite stop Faye. That's why you're losing King of Boom, because you're playing Genshin right now. Okay, going for the pin. Giga Chad right there, though. Oh. Big, big foot. Straight to his his chest to interrupt King of Doom. But... This one's hard, because I feel like the Chosen are cringe and the Council are cringe, so I don't know who to like root for. I feel like I just want to root for the council just because Faye's there, but... Oh, okay. Sparring bounced off the map. Straight off his face there oh, with that move. One, Going for the pin. Two. two. Kick, Kick out at two. That's not the end for Spiron quite yet. Okay. Conserving energy. The council swapping now. Members. King of Doom is the active man. Looking to maybe do something from the top rope, but Spiron is up and managing to get to the corner quickly. Oh. Oh, oh, and oh, a real Spiron reversal. Trying to tried pull to... him down, but it didn't happen. Oh, Giga Chad, you were too slow. To the face. Giga Chad went for the swing in midair. Yeah, this is the only match where you're rooting for the counter. Wait a second. Just because there. No, no, no. This is not right. Oh. King of Doom delivering a Spiron. suplex. Ah. And now to the top rope. Spiron is down. What's the plan? Ooh. Oh, a back bomb something or other. I'm not sure what that was, but... Giga Chad, you've got to interrupt this because it might be. <laughs> Wait. Giga Chad. Giga Chad, you. He... he was. He was right. He was right there. He was right there. Giga Chad, all you had to do. <laughs> was, was just, just. He went after ref. <laughs> well, what's that about? <laughs> Why has he done that to me, to Spiron? Why has Giga Chad done this? I am angry with Giga Chad now. I tell you, he is no longer my friend.
How could he do this? And the way he just... The fact that he moved away Bro, he literally just well. ran past. He might as well have been running to the back. To the changing rooms, man. <laughs> I can't believe this. That is actually really I am actually outraged <laughs> at this moment. Okay. So this is another tag team match. Now, Cupid and John are not a tag team. That's not a thing at the moment, unless they decide that they want that. Um, but after doing so well together against the council, we thought, you know what, let's go against another tag team. Let's just, let's just try it out a little bit. Let's just see how it goes. So they're going against the Burly Boys today. Your beta. <laughs> right. Standing there menacingly. He wasn't even standing there menacingly. He was just stood there, not doing anything. He wasn't even stood there. He literally got up and ran past. <laughs> he didn't even stand there. He actively <laughs> ran out of the way Can to allow the pin to happen. Council member. Oh, oh. I can't it. Right. Well, listen. Words will be had. I'm. I'm. I'm telling you. Words will be had backstage between the the chosen because what an absolute disaster of a of a faction they have <laughs> they have become. Yeah, that was from wasn't, forming that wasn't good. with fear in the hearts of all the other members of the Baby Bunting Wrestling roster to being the absolute joke of the division. I can't believe this. And I'm a part of this. I have to be associated with these losers, Joey <laughs> One and Giga Chad. Burly Disgusting. Boys. Burly boys. Right. It's not necessarily gone for good, Skinner. Also trying to point to life, guys. Um, I just don't know where it would fit. That's 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 the only thing. I don't know where it would fit now. With streaming. Cause I do like the idea of it coming back. But I just don't know where it would fit. Yeah, because I think you've said before now you don't want to interrupt like the flow of Yeah, the I don't streams. want it to I don't want to interrupt the flow of wrestling. I want wrestling to just be able to carry on. But then I think it's difficult on the community nights, because if we're all playing a game and stuff like that, I feel like it disrupts the flow then if you're trying to get into new matches or things like that. Hmm. So can you be saying you can only, I have only thought one about doing stream, that. It could always be that someone redeems it and then you do it like at the very end of the stream before you finish. It's not a bad idea, maybe. It just depends on if people be willing to do it and then if obviously if they didn't mind that they might not be there at the end of the stream and that we do I it. I mean, if we put it in the thing like Crappy Doodle at the end of the stream or something. Yeah. You just put it in the channel point thing and saying if uh, this will... This entitles you to one crappy doodle drawn at the end of the stream. Maybe. What do you guys think? Would you be happy with that being like at the end of the stream? I think if like I was playing like like um like a random game, like if I was doing it on the weekend, like like say like I guess when I like I did the bathhouse, mm. could have maybe have just paused it and done it in there. Yeah, that wouldn't have been too bad. Like, found a stopping point. Yeah. But then it's quite good if it's, like, one at the end of the stream. It's like, oh, it's, like, I don't know. Because then you're, like, it gives me time to, like, think about it. And... But then I, I just, it's obviously a bit of a tricky one if somebody redeems it. And then it's like, oh, they're not going to actually be there at the end of the stream and they'll miss it. Yeah. When next Minecraft Minecraft stream, I have big plans. Bruh, I don't even like doing the Minecraft streams anymore because it's so much lag. I can't even do it. Like, I have to turn all the stuff off now because there's so much lag. Yeah, we need to have a look and see if there's a way yeah, of us keeping it on. And it's, that's, not that it's making it not fun because it's just lagging and it's like I'm having to turn all the settings down and everything because... There's so much lag on it. So I'll have a think. I'll have a think. Um, I'll have a think. John is ready. <laughs> Interesting that they don't come out together, John and Q. We're clearly not that good friends yet. But they don't want to come out at the same oh, time. They, they just need to fight together. They don't need to be like seen together other than that that's fair king of doom but that's because you're not streaming it 
like when you're trying to stream it and it's like that it makes it so much harder because obviously my stream is requiring like the internet to stream and things I think we know why the server is lagging models. I think there's I think there's just too much stuff that all got built in the same place. And it's like stuff that's so massive. I think that's just why. Yeah. Whereas if I think it'd been done at more of a distance, I think it would have been alright. I do want to do some more, but I just don't know. To be honest, it's gone from a realm to something that just seems like a single player world. No one logs on, like, where the hell are you all at? For example, Cupid, you have base plans, but don't log on. And other people are like, bro, where are you all at? Well, for me, it's more like... I prefer playing it when, like, we're playing it all together. That's, like, how I want to play it. Um, and I think it's just a case of just everyone's busy and it's, like, it's hard to dedicate... Yeah, to be fair. A lot of time to it. A lot of people's plans and times changed. Going oh, for the ref days. as always! Since the beginning of when we formed the uh, realm initially. Hmm. A lot of people obviously have less time to be on all the time now. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. It's like I barely get time to play games anyways. Which is half the reason I stream. Just to force like myself to make time to play games. So like... It makes it hard then. This is why, like, I'm not, like... This is why I can't feel like I can't get into, like, Genshin and things. Because it's, like, this so uh, time-consuming. And when I have so little time to play games. And to just do any other hobbies. That it's, like, you're really quite fussy then about what you do. Where is King of Doom? Because you're still quite young. You have a lot more time. Um, so it's my problem is y'all a decade too late. I have outgrown Minecraft. Yeah, I guess that's the thing as well. It's nice. I, I like it for those evenings and I like it to see like what everybody's built in their downtime and things like that. But like, I mean, it could uh, there's no harm in like, like, you know, messaging each other and just being like, oh, would everybody like to play Minecraft like this day, this time kind of thing. Because then, like, if you dedicate, if you, like, plan it ahead, like, I think that goes a bit better. Whereas, like, if you're just logging on anyways, you might, like, people would just be missing each other anyways a bit. Oh. Waddle's just chopping the air there. Very good. <laughs> he can keep it up. Bla oh, oh like, slams it onto like, John, yeah. yeah. Landed on his horn there. That's going to hurt. Nearly impale his eye. Well, Cupid... Having a bit of a bad time being thrown onto not only John but to the corner of the ring as well now. Oh, 100%. I what? keep, I keep, keep saying this to you. Among Us VR, when that comes out, you 100% need to give that a go. That would be so We need funny. everybody else who has a VR to also get it as well. So then we can all play together. Because I feel like that would make it better. That is true. Back when Waddles was a wee and he played Minecraft non-stop. Now I'm a grown man I found other interests. Oh, John missed Waddles diving out of the way so fast. See, I'm sad because I've had to like turn off all the stuff that makes it look pretty. I know, we'll definitely need to figure out a way to turn, yeah. keep that turned on and try to keep lag to a minimum. Yeah, I think it's just more, just not that people don't want to. I think it's just people just have a lot of time. My new plans will create lots of fun for me after three months of building and planning. It will pay off. As long as you don't make it lag more. I am speed. 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 It's me. Speed. Right, well, Cupid has Jim on his shoulders. Jim. Now on the floor. Cupid going for the pin. See, I'm rooting for the belly boys here. Oh my goodness. Oh, I thought that was it. I feel like the <laughs> ref should have tapped that. And he I was did. a bit scared for the belly oh. boys there. Come on, belly boys. You can't let some randomers beat you. Oh, we're going oh. for Suplex City. That's one. Two. Two. Can we get a third? Can we get a third? Anyone for a third? Bam, that's the third. 
Okay. Go and pull him away from the rope. Do it quick. Burly Boy is in control. Oh. Jim locking in a move that will try and choke Cupid out. Put him to sleep. Oh, John's here. Oh, but Waddles takes him out as well. Ooh. Taking him into the middle. Indeed, John. Out for the count on the outside of the ring, it looks like. Jim going for the pin on Cupid. One, two. Oh, a kick out of two. Out. It's not enough. Not enough yet. Jim says, send him Waddles. Finish the job. What's his plan here? Oh, just step on his toes. Yep. Oh, break his arm. Oh, going once, going twice. Gone. <laughs> oh, my days. All right, Cupid now fighting back, though. In control of Waddles. In fact, lifts Waddles oh. in the air now. Oh, and there's John. Hello. John's back up and ready. Oh, come on, Waddles. One, two. two. John making sure that Jim oh. can't do anything. He tried to run over to Jim to stop him, but... Takes more than that to keep Waddles down, though. Yeah, Jim very he's confident. He's had his beans. He's had his ritual bath. Oh, my days. Locking in. Locking in. Oh, Jim oh. bouncing off the ropes. Trying to figure it out. Okay, there we go. Sorted. <laughs> that was close. Oh, Cupid fighting both Waddles and Jim at the same time now. Focusing his attention on Jim while Waddles is out on the floor. Okay, back. Attention now on Waddles. Cupid, what's the plan? Oh! Oh my days, Jim's still in the ring. Jim, get out of there. Wow, the strength. Cupid. Oh, the big knee. Waddles in trouble, maybe, here. Jim's looking on from outside the ring. Jim, you need to be there so he can tag you in. Okay, Waddles in the corner. In a bit of trouble. Oh, but actually manages to reverse it. Oh, and the strength. Absolutely slams Cupid to the floor. Yeah. Come on, Waddles. Pin him. Pin him. Oh. Going for the pin. One. Two. two. Oh. oh, man. He's so close. Oh, my days. Cupid on the floor. Okay, now Jim being tagged in. Cupid trying to figure out which direction he needs to crawl to find John again, but he one. can't find him. Oh, oh managed to kick out a quick one kick out there. Cupid's got to make his way over to the corner at this point. Whoa, he needs to get John in. Dislocate his arm there. Cupid in a lot of trouble, I feel like. If he doesn't tag John in soon, I think this might be over and the Billy Boys might take this victory. Oh, and a big elbow drop from the top row. This might be... Oh, all but over, he says. But actually, Cupid managed to reverse it and does tag in John finally. John now up against Jim Bob, John Dave James. What can he do to bring the team back to control. So I can get that King of Doom a bit because like I didn't play like Ooh. It's like flood. Jump, yeah. Flood out man. Um like I like never had any mates who like played games and stuff like that. Which obviously is like a bit different but like none of my mates ever played games. I always felt like I was really weird for playing them. But I just found it hard because like you couldn't talk to anybody about them and like definitely couldn't ever play with anyone which is why i never played online actually until i got with spyron um but yeah at least uh, like you haven't got long left of high school because i know like everything has gone a bit wrong with your friends but like at least like there isn't super long left hey it's a turtle move hey <laughs> What is that though? Like, so what is they go round and round and round and round and then just slap them on the head. Yeah. Uh, it just doesn't even make sense to me. Right, well, Jamie, here we go. Locking it in again. Turtle time. Waddle's going to go make sure that Cupid doesn't interrupt. Having a little tussle. John's still in it though. Not tapped out yet, but actually going for the pin. Referee, just get down on the floor, man. One, <laughs> two. two. Oh, oh, the ref scooped that so bad. Billy boys won't be happy with that one. Referee playing for the other side, it seems. Oh, John, trying to get away. Oh, oh. actually just drop kicks his legs. Oh, Ooh. 
Ooh. Wow, very well powerful. Done. Okay, now John to the top row, but actually Jim manages to get all the way to the other end very quickly to tag in Waddles. Uh... Oh, Ooh. that locks Waddles up there. I and Waddles seen that one before. might be done for here. Waddles, Jim nowhere to be seen, out for the count. Oh, oh. it's a kick out. It is close. This is really close. Oh, going for the Trouble in Paradise style kick, but Waddles gets his hands up and blocks it. What's the plan now? Waddles going for the bomb. Sideways flip onto the floor. This is bad news for John and Cupid, but Cupid is ready. Can he just interrupt? All he needs to do is just, yeah, a little bit of a tap. There we go. Interrupt the pin. Not much to be done about that, unfortunately, for the Burley boys. I feel like that could have been the end of the... The match there if Cupid hadn't been quick there. So, very good. Oh, wow. The strength on Waddles. Using all that energy, though, to slam Cupid, who isn't the legal man. John, the legal man. Oh, and wrapping his arm around the ropes. Oh. That makes you bread? No. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that, Skinner. Yeah, Waddles is the same. Yeah, it, I feel like as an adult, like, I've I've only had mates to play games with simply because I started streaming and play games with you guys. Um, and so it's good in that I, like, I don't always have time to, like, to do it over them, like, a lot of time when the streams are on. Oh, no. But we said about, like, we said about doing Stardew, haven't we, King of Doom, at some point? Oh, my days. John's going, like, mad at the minute, guys. Going for the pin on Billy Boy. Oh, but Whoa. Jim, there are nowhere Easy. to interrupt. Well played to Jim. The right. Burley boys in sync, saving each other. But John, no, John, the knees to oh, his face. Look, look at, at his, his face. He's bleeding so bad. John has just popped off onto another level here. Oh, He's going to the top rope. He's going for his finishing move. Here he goes. He's setting it up. But Waddles, oh, oh. I thought he got out of the way, but actually he caught his neck on the way down. Could this be it? Going for the pin. Where it. is Jim? Can Jim One, save him? Two. two. Oh! Just. Just managed to kick out Waddles. Oh, but that's a big move. I don't know if Waddles can survive much longer. Someone needs to help this man. Oh. Yeah, King of Doom. We should try and do League of Legends again as well at some point. Because that was really good. Oh, my days. Here he goes. John again. The big move. Today, Johnny boy. Oh, Waddles, can he reach the ropes? I don't think he can. I don't know where Jim is. I don't think it's enough. No! <laughs> oh my goodness me, that's another win for the random tag team of John and Cupid. Interesting. Well, well, well. Let's have a word with John and Cupid and see if this is something that they would like or if they would like to. I mean, a lot of that was, a lot of that was John today, but I mean, I mean Cupid John, also yeah, came pop, in very off strong. At the end, to be fair. Okay, maybe today. <laughs> the slap front sound from the bread command synced perfectly with John slapping my tum tum. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's happened to the replay, but guys, that was a great bit of action there. We yeah. saw there that black screen. Best part of the match. Well, well, well. Look Potentially, new tag like team staring on the menacingly at Cupid there. Your boy Cupid won. And look how excited do, they are. Do you and Cupid play games as well now? Wow, congratulations. Yeah, yeah, I just think if you are ever wanting to play with anyone in the server, just use those server channels and just post in and just be like, oh, at Minecraft, does any is anybody like free to play? Or like, does anybody want to play like tomorrow or something like that? And it gives like people some notice and things like that. And it might not happen. Um, because I know like I've done it before and like there hasn't always been people available. But it could that could be worth doing as well. Now this is an interesting little bout that we're about to witness. Skingiwi, Baby Bunting, and Pooh Bear in the same ring, triple threat. Scary times, potentially. Mm. What do you think of this? I'm not holding out any hope for Bunting. She's just not doing very well for herself anymore. But then Pooh Bear's not doing very well for himself. I feel like this might just be a Skingiwi win because, I mean, she's doing well for herself nowadays. Well, guys, if you think you know who's going to win, don't forget to put those channel points on the line. Channel point prediction is now live. John has too much stamina and youthful vigor. We just couldn't keep up. Oh. Oh. 
yeah you and cuba play games together but haven't done recently because he streams at 11 p.m like bro i'm going to sleep now bro why is he streaming at 11 p.m tell him to stop streaming so late poop bear bro what, i mean like like playing games like not on stream as well like Me, Cupid, Faye, and Stevie have talked about playing Genshin and I finish a quest. Oh, that sounds really good. See, Cupid? Uh, not Cupid. See, can you do, like... Sounds like you're playing with more people than I am, mate. Here's Bunting. Coming out confident, although I'm not sure why she's feeling confident when she's been laying herself down pretty oh, much every week. Let's uh, see. Hold on. How are... How is Bay going out to do it? Two and two? Two, so, two, I guess. That's not, not bad, actually. Bad. I think you're putting she yourself down a little bit. She lost to Spiron, though. It's all right. Come here. It's all right. Not me. It's, it's all right. I know, but you're also a good representation of Baby Bunting there in the wrestling, so it's okay. <laughs> it's all right. You're doing okay as Baby Bunting. <laughs> that's like Both the perfect streaming, squad Streaming and wrestling going quite well. Quest disables co-op, what a pain. Oh man, that sucks. Bunting going down. Why? Why are you being mean, bro? What's, there's no need to say poo because he's not actually a real person. Be mean to him. <laughs> We're trying to hurt a real person's feelings, bro. Yeah, obviously we didn't want to see Skangiri versus Gabe. That match has been saved for the uh, Merry Spookums pay-per-view next week. And so... Skingi, we're going to test her, test her bouts and her wits against Baby Bunting, friend and colleague, obviously, mm -hmm. worth working, Baby Bunting Wrestling, uh, and Pooh Bear, who maybe not so much a friend, but also a former champion, of course, so. But I think she has defeated Pooh Bear before, I think. Yeah, certainly, I'm sure she has. Weighing in at 157 pounds, the superstar. Sewer, Dweller, Tequila, Greasy Head, Skengiwi. There we go. I'm excited if a VR Phasmophobia stream happens. That's definitely, that is definitely a plan. Um, I just want to figure out like a day that works for like everyone. And because there's like only four people can play. We'd have to maybe do it as like a, we'll like, alternate who's taking turns. But yeah, that's honestly, that is written down. That is definitely going to happen. I'm just trying to think of a good date that works for like uh, that'll work for everyone who wants to play because yeah. there's, there's a few people. <laughs> Why Skinner's? <laughs> because you've been chicken off your VRs at home and not at uni, are you? If it's at home, I'll wait till you're at home to do it then. Ah, uh -huh. good, oh, good planning. What a great friend, don't you agree, Skinny? What a great friend, allowing you to play. Phasmophobia in its true glory. Yes, uh... Ah, uh, yes. Do you need both? Ah, oh, she'd actually love to play the VR. Ghost be like, ooh, new people would say, oh, great heavens. Excuse me, breaking the game. No. I'm breaking all the games, bro. I want to see some more Pooh Bear rage, man. Like, we haven't had some rage from him for a while. See, I don't love playing VR. Like, that one time we did it before with Gabe. I'm like... You literally would not enter the house. <laughs> literally, we watched you for 30 minutes on the stream. Stand, stand outside the house. All right, I'm sorry. Do better! <laughs> Next time, go in the house, fight a ghost. Let's say, don't be sorry, be better. Like Kratos says... Did the announcer just call him Willie the Bear? He's always been calling him Willie the Bear and you've never questioned it until now. Months have gone by, Waddles, while you've never questioned <laughs> him being called Willie the Bear. The game isn't on your headset, so you need them both at the same time. Oh, yeah, because technically this, the VR headset's her dad's, isn't it? Her dad's the, the VR gamer. He's the Beat Saber expert of the, the Skin Gooey <laughs> household, I forgot. <laughs> oh, man. It's all right. Well, some of us could do VR, some of us not. Oh, no, because I'll be using mine skinners, so that doesn't work. Taking turns? Oh, you can do... You can each take a step each. I'm so the streamer. I don't take turns. Oh, sorry. 
Everyone else has to take turns instead. I am an obedient wrestler. I do not ask questions. <laughs> then why are you asking now? Take turns, bro. I'll take turns with Spiron. Okay, here I'm we really go. torn as to who's going to win. Make sure you voted, guys. Yeah. Oh, Pooh Bear was having his little vibrate then for a second. Oh, Skengiwi targeting Baby Bunny straight away. Drops her to the floor. And now drops Pooh Bear to the floor. Skengiwi going all out this match, it seems. Bunny looked like she was just fixing her hair instead of fighting then. No. Wait, watch out, Baby Bunting. It's no. a Pooh Bear. Oh. <laughs> Baby Bunting, come on. Oh my days, the choke slam. Bruh. Oh, but Skin Kiwi just dropped Pooh Bear there with a couple of fists and feet. Oh, but Bunting's like, nope, I need to have some action, please. Here we go. Oh. Pooh Bear showing off. <laughs> All right, here we go. Suplex, Ooh. Baby Bunting. I feel like he flung away like such fast there. Yeah, oh, baby, but he's going for a sleep now. Going for a nap on the outside for the time being. So it's just King Yui and Pooh Bear left in the ring. Ooh. Oh. Elbow. I mean, as long as Bunting doesn't get pinned, it's not a loss. It's true. True, you can avoid it that way. That is correct. Funny thing, actually, I was scrolling through my phone, old photos, to clear out old memes, and saw a 12 year old me breaking a game. I was like, 12 year old me wouldn't have guessed I'd do this on a monthly basis now. <laughs> what game was it when you were 12 year old, King of Doom? Gosh, man. Pooh Bear, no mercy on bunting today. Yeah, rocking Baby Bunting with a the fist there. But, oh, looks like Baby Bunting actually managed to... I trying to make like a Rocky joke then. Like... Oh. Have we watched oh. those films? I have Together. not. Have you watched any of those? Uh, not with you. Oh. I've only seen the first one, I think. Oh, okay. I don't remember any of it, though, so... Fair. It's on our watch list. It's Lego Marvel superheroes on Xbox 360. Man, I love the Marvel game. Not the Marvel games. I love the Lego games. They're really good. Like, they are well made. Like, I do feel like they put an effort into them. A question for you and for everyone in chat. Yeah. Obviously the most recent shift in lego oh. games oh my days there you are for our bunting's face Pooh Bear. disrespect the most recent shift in the lego games is actually them adding voices to the characters oh that man be a honestly thing. right are you right, pro right, anti-lego voice literally i'm pro voice right so okay i i absolutely flipping loved it so like i didn't even know that they had added voices until I played that first Batman Lego game where they introduced the voices and I sat there playing it with my brother and we were just like, wait, what? Like, we didn't know beforehand that the voices had been introduced. Okay. And I've just, I, I've got no issues of it. I don't see why there is an issue. The only thing I think I, I'd, I miss more now that there isn't, uh, or that there is voices, sorry, I should say, yeah. is the, the jokes that they have to do to try and convey what they're speaking. And so, do you know, the the best example is there's the, the Lego Star Wars one. Yeah. Where, he, where Darth Vader's trying to tell Luke that he's his father. And obviously, they don't speak. So he's like, pointing to like baby photos. He's like, that's me. I'm your dad. That's me. And he's pulling up all these yeah, like, stupid so things. Yeah, like those stuff That are really kind of good. stuff uh, gets but missed I now. I still sadly, feel but. like... Um, you are violently anti-voice. Why, Waddles? Go on. You actually hate that Lego Star Wars Skywalker game has no character creation like bro. Oh, that's a shame. That the character a creation's always like one of the cooler bits as well. Yeah, that was always a fun bit. It's so much more humorous and creative when they were silent. It's just boring now they talk. I guess that is true. I think like, I can definitely see what you mean. Like, I think the problem is it's been so long since I've like played them. I don't remember really that they did those creative things but now that you've said it yeah it is like a bit of a shame if they're not then putting that same like energy and effort into it at the, at the least very least i guess what they've had to, what they've managed to like avoid in terms of like having to come up with like stupid stuff for Ooh, the non-voice acting every time to convey stuff 
they've made up for in all the animation and all the, like the actual stuff in the Lego games is still pretty sick. Which I guess they've had more time to focus on that potentially. Oh, King of Doom, that is a sadness, man. Lego Dimensions was good. Lego Dimensions was pretty good. They had loads of like different characters and stuff. Bro, had, like, I was like, like, like I would have like, literally, no I think if I had been like working at the time I was playing it. Oh my goodness, King of Doom. What the flip? I'd have literally bought all those packs. Like, like, I would have, I would have, man. It's dangerous, I was, man. I'm yeah. so, this is my problem with stuff though. It's like, I, I, when I'm interested in something, I want all of it. Like, I want to collect all of it. And this is like such an issue I found with games. Like, oh. Oh no, the honey pot locked in on baby bunting. No, not the honey pot. Get out of it, Bunting. Get out of it. Get out of it. Oh, Skingiri breaks it up. Skingiri breaks it up. She doesn't want the match to end right now. Oh, Skingiri, gotta break it up again. There we go. Thanks, Skingiri. Yeah, you get Pooh Bear. I'll just lie down for a bit. Okay. Pooh Bear. No! Oh! oh the knees! Bunting for the knees up. The knees have been bunting. raised. And Baby Bunting oh, is now in control. Oh, face. What's the plan here? Oh! oh. Okay. Come on, Baby Bunting. You need this good. for once. Oh, my days. Oh. The baby bunt! Bang! Come on, no! Pooh Bear's coming! Pooh Bear's coming, you're too late! Quickly! Bunty! No! You're he's already late. here! He's already here! Watch out! Going for the pin, but he's right there! Oh, oh. Bunting! The too baby late. bunt was delivered to Skengiwi, but took too long to do anything about it afterwards. Oh! He's not happy with Pooh Bear about that. Oh, Skingiwi's opted to have a rest, but oh. <laughs> Baby Bunting's having it's none like of it. He's choking her out. <laughs> How dare you sit down? <laughs> We're in a wrestling match, don't you know? <laughs> Pooh Bear just showing off. Oh, never mind. He was ready, though. Oh. Oh, like a proper pop up bow bomb. Um, Skingiwi's right there, Pooh Bear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to say. Oh. oh. Rocked King Hugh with the big boot there. Yeah, your mum finds our commentary very funny. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Mungie Wee. Thank you for oh, my enjoying days. our commentary. What the flip? Babe Hunting, you're having a flail there. You you don't look like you're in a good shape here. I'm worried for you. Wait. Oh, no. Bunting tap? No, okay. Okay. Bunting is safe. Oh, no, oh, never mind. Never mind. Oh, never mind. <laughs> oh no. Skinners, why didn't you get me? Skengiwi, where were you to save the day? Oh, I'm so sorry. Bruh. Oh, bunting, no. Not to poo bear. Oh, it just couldn't be done. It couldn't be done. Skengiwi, you can see her there, flat out on the floor. <laughs> Nothing to be done. Well, you As... don't get a win now either, Skinners. You don't get anything. But it's not a loss, at least. It's not a loss. That is true. I think what did it for me was Lord of the Rings Lego games because they literally just took the audio from the movies and it sounded awful. No, that's rubbish. Like, it needs... Like, I only remember it really for the Batman one and I feel like they were still really comical with it. Mm. But I feel like they always put a lot of effort into the Batman ones. Like, Willie the Poop Bear win. <laughs> Do you all like the uh, the faith emote, guys? I'm ready for whenever we actually do the faith stream. I'm so I... excited. I, I'm really like keen to watch you play. Yeah, I'm really excited. Thank you, I'd like. I'm. I'm very keen to play it. I just like. I'm. I just like. I want to do it when like you guys who are here for like chapter one and two are here for it. Cause like I want to like experience it together like we did initially. Skinners, you can't see the can, emote. Oh, can, you see it? can you see it on the screen? You can kind of see it. Look yeah, up can the you top. see it just above? It's Michael wiggling. Hold on. I'll, I'll do some more of them. Look, there, there they all are. I'm going to wiggle. Do you remember when you. Michael, King of Doom, was like... um, He was like in the basement and then he escaped through the window. And then we found out he was in chapter one. And he's that white thing that comes at you really fast. And... In one of the endings, you can kill it. Yeah, it's King of Doom the yeah, whole time. King of Doom is in Faith, Chapter 2 and Chapter 1. Yeah. 
I wonder if King of Doom, do you show up in chapter three? Do you know? I hope so. What? I didn't know such thing. What are you talking about? <laughs> you, that's you. That emo is you. <laughs> you wiggling. <laughs> now, guys, this is the final match of the night. <laughs> Doom's not trying to kill the bumpkin. Our champion Gabe is a bit rattled because Can not only not only did he lose to Skengiwi in a one-on-one -on -one normal match, he also got absolutely obliterated in that tables match, if you remember last week, where Skengiwi literally, like, clotheslined him through the table in the first, like, five seconds of the match. Yes. It was not even close. So, in order to refine himself and, and find his roots again, his, his great wrestling skill and ability that we know he has, he's going back to an old opponent, DJ Simtax, to take him on. To maybe try and get his mojo back a little bit. Yeah, to feel a bit more like confident about himself. Taking on somebody he knows he can beat. Who he has beaten before. Oh, Skin has pushed Gabe off the balcony at AJR as well. Oh, no. Yeah, dude, why are you always trying to kill me when I'm playing Faith, bro? Guys, it's channel point predictions are live also. Make sure you get your points in. Get yeah, points in. at least it wasn't Cupid. Exactly. There you go. Woman's very excited in the crown, saying, "All right, this is it. That's what she, this is the match she came for, clearly." Yeah, she's excited all the way from <laughs> Uddersfield to Leeds to watch <laughs> Game versus DJ Simtax. Bikini bottom, bikini bottom. Come on, where's the bikini bottom chant Man, we normally have, guys? I Where so is it? so so wish. Eventually, I hope one day there's a wrestling game, be it WWE or not, that just lets you have so much more control over what goes on in the I'd game. I'd love it if we could, like, control the outcomes of the matches, control, like, certain things that could happen. Yeah, like... in more detail than it just be, oh, so-and-so can run in, like, at a certain point in the match, and that's, like, as cool as maybe some Here matches can be. Here he is with his belt on. But, yeah, I feel like it would be really cool because, like, with actual wrestling, they decide what's going to happen. Like, they decide the outcomes, they decide, like, little tidbits of stuff, and it would be so cool to be able to decide it and all. Because then you can proper run with a proper storyline then. Yeah, it'd be like, so much better. At the to, moment, like, build we make stories. up as we go along, just simply because we don't know what the outcomes of the matches will be. Which is interesting and sometimes Which I, a bit more I honestly fun. like, and yeah. I, I definitely like it. But, like, it makes it hard then, because you're like, oh. What should we plan? Who should fight against who? And trying to think. <gasps> You've passed Huddersfield. No, I think you got it right the first time. Pa that version of past is correct. Yeah, I think you were right the first time. You're not in the past. Ask Mungiwi. <laughs> Huddersfield. I've had a side quest from the very start and just finished it now, but I've been waiting for months. What? How? Is it just because the, the way that the game is? Or just that you've just left it? For a while. Kini bottom. Kini bottom. Just stayed in all this field. Oh. Oh no. Gabe, come on. I think he's really lost his mojo, guys. He just completely <laughs> forgot about it. Fair enough. I thought you were gonna say it's because like the game is so grindy you couldn't complete it for mums. Yeah, your mum said you go right the first time, that's okay. Then. Well done, well done. Okay, oh, Ooh. here we go, the classic Baby fists to the face. Do you think he's going to whip out the bikini bottom today? I mean, I hope so, because that is the key to his victory strategy. Did you do a vote? I did, okay. indeed. Try and sneeze sound like Among Us fart sound effect. What? What? Did you sneeze? Yeah, I sneezed. I didn't even hear you. Oh, my days. <laughs> I mean, it's better than the time that I sneezed in Spiron's stream and you all, like, absolutely took the mick out of me for ages. Ooh. It was a dog in the background. <laughs> I wasn't going to say what it was. <laughs> <laughs> well, I did, so. Oh, holding hands together there. Oh, that's cute. Whoa. Oh, that's less cute. More violent. It's funny as well because the crowd went, oh. <laughs> At least you thought a dog was in the house. I was even kidding. He's so mean. Here we go. Gabe going for the pin. One. Two. Oh, one. I was going to say surely that When are we going to have a Spiron stream? Spiron channel so quiet. Because he always streams on the British esports instead. 
We have said about you doing Monkey Island. I still do need to do a run through the Monkey Island game, yeah, for sure. One, two, two. kick out again. It'd be funny as well, because I bet you already know and remember how to do everything in the game. I probably do. I probably could run through the game, like, fully with you all <laughs> and tell you all about I it. I think, right, you should do, like, you should find a day and do a marathon of all, like, the, like, of the Monkey Island games, like, the, the ones that you really like, like, one, two, and this one. Yeah. Yeah, one, two, three, this one are probably the ones I have the best memory of. Yeah. Where does this one take off from? Uh, it's complicated and it's kind of a spoiler to talk about. Well, yeah, but like the scene though, yeah, it's like it does kind of follow on from the end of one of them though. Yeah, so it, it kind of follows on from two, but that's not that was... exactly right. Yes, I, I know. So... I get what you mean, but. Sparring sneeze again. I didn't hear it, so I didn't get the joke. Okay, no, give me. No, I didn't hear it either as well. Give me a couple of minutes. I'm sure it'll happen. Do you erase he monkeys in Monkey Island? Does he mean the? I th I'm assuming there's a T missing. <laughs> if you erase the monkeys. No, you, you go to Monkey Island, you what is it? You, you There's a curse of Monkey Island, there's a secret of Monkey Island, there's a return to Monkey Island, there's tales on Monkey Island. Lots of things, not necessarily any any erasing of monkeys. The monkeys are all quite helpful actually Ooh. in some games. You should speedrun the Monkey Island games, bro. Sounds too boring, just burn Monkey Island. I don't know what Monkey Island is, but yeah, that can burn no, then instead no, of Monkey no, Island. No, no, it's not boring at all. Oh my god, this is the Bikini Bomb! We've just missed it, basically, and now it's the MR1! Bikini Bomb! Bikini Bikini Bomb! Oh! Bro, that was like... That was it. Nobody even kicked out! What even happened there? Sparrow's channel got abused, suspended for animal abuse. No, no, don't be spreading these false well, that's what, rumors. That is the reason. That's why it's not allowed to stream anymore. Gabe now going for the pin straight after a bikini bottom. Oh, bikini bottom, bikini bottom. Ooh. Oh, Gabe going for a couple of moves We're on his own now. We're going to let him get it up. Okay, is this where Gabe takes control then? He's been hit by a bikini bottom and has managed to survive it. Ooh. Bikini bottom getting weaker and weaker, I feel like, every week. It's not going well for Simtax. Oh, oh knee to the face, knee to the face. And a little abuse, so you do abuse the monkey's instant purchase. Okay. First one, you kill, you kill some dogs. One, two. Wow, Ooh. there we go. Okay, nice. well, but congratulations, Gabe. Back. But I mean, that still wasn't as fast as we wouldn't have normally destroyed him. No, so I'll be interested to see what happens next week. Cooks rat soup every week. Yes, that's true. No, 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 no. Go on, so what's the animal abuse in each of the Monkey Island games? I can't tell you. There's no abuse. Bruh, come on. No, no. Is the rat soup in number two? Um, yes, that is two. Whoa, wait a second! Gabe! In trouble, as Spyron actually enters the ring. What's this about? What's Spyron doing? Gabe's trying to get away. Gabe's trying to run away. Spyron. Oh, he's not even, he don't even look behind him. He's like, I am not scared of Spyron. Oh. <laughs> What's going on? Hey. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what just happened? The me, Faye, Cupid, and Gabe have all won the council. Have all won. The council is doing good. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's true. He got away! <laughs> the way he did a 360 no scope, then won. <laughs> Man, as if he's literally just like done like a little run around. Like, what even was that? Maybe like once he gets over the line, you're not allowed to touch him. I don't know how. Maybe he thought you were playing tag.